Hello, this is Peter Phelps of Phelps TV. So, yeah, I decided to tear that back off and put it together like this so that I could use the table itself as a, a surface to square this. Because all these pieces are moving, and the only four points that are holding it are the four corner and bottom parts. So it's really difficult to get it all square trying to just assemble it there on the other part. Um, I, I, if it were me, I would have added four more of these little 90 degree angle brackets to help keep this square inside the corners or even something outside. Just something to hold it at another point just having these four points and you're trying to assemble it on that on the other deck part just doesn't work it's it's ridiculous trying to get everything lined up right so I took it off I did what I said before I squared it up here and I created it so it's all one part it's much much better than it would have came out if I was still trying to play with all those parts but I still think that it would have been beneficial to add 40, 90, four more 90 degree angle brackets in, in the corners here just to help because you only have those these four holding it together and it, it's kind of weak I mean if I, I jerk it too much one way or the other it's going to come back out of square so I might have to invest in some more parts just because I don't I don't like that I don't like how easy it would be to knock this back out of square um, so I'm going to put this back on to the other section and this section Okay, I'm going to have to play with this for a while, but basically you get the, you get the gist. This slides into those parts, if I can get them together. Now, these long pieces here, I found out that they're 22 inches, so basically, hopefully I should look for that mark first. backwards um, but I made a little mark here in, in the permanent marker it's at 11 inches because this thing is 22 inches and what I did is I lined it up with the uh, shaft in the stepper motor Yeah, I'll be back in a bit. You, you, you get the gist.